A national economic crisis could affect every student in Colorado who receives financial aid. Local colleges are already taking action. The financial aid crisis started with home loans. Because the mortgage market is unstable and declining, major banks are getting out of the student loan business because they're losing money in it. And now Sally May, the biggest financial aid provider, is considering following suit. Nine News education reporter Nelson Garcia joins us from the Auraria campus, where college leaders are addressing a possible collapse of the system. Nelson? Bozzi, Sally May writes the most student loans by far, but now their leaders are saying that it's just causing them to lose way too much money. If they go out, experts worry about the availability of financial aid, a problem that could affect students at campuses across Colorado, but it will especially affect students at community colleges, the ones who depend on financial aid the most. The Colorado Community College system affects 120,000 students. People like sophomore Sharon Montgomery, who attends the Community College of Denver. I'm a single parent. Um, I have a two-year-old son, and I want to go to school to provide a better living for myself and for him. Montgomery has enough to worry about, let alone the possibility that financial aid giant Sally May, the leading provider of student loans, is now thinking about pulling out of the financial aid business. Because it's already hard enough to get loans and scholarships as it is, but, you know, if the main part of the piece is going to fall out, then that's really going to be extremely hard for us. It could affect every college student, you bet. Dr. Nancy McCallan is the president of the community college system. This morning, she sent this letter to all 13 campuses, outlining her concerns over the financial aid crisis and what she and her staff have been doing about it. In order to assure that we have as many options available to our students, we've been reaching out to banks across the country mm -hmm. and within Colorado. These words show their actions of trying to get enough other banks to sign on to make sure no matter what happens, especially to Sally May, loans are available to students. So I think that it's really important that we get ahead of this game, mm -hmm. especially for the fall 2008 um, enrollment. Well, I think that's good. They should keep that up. Otherwise, they're going to lose a lot of students because they're not able to provide them with the financial aid that they need. Dr. McAllen says that she's received enough responses from other banks that if Sally May does in fact go out, she's confident that students will still get their money. Bozzi. Nelson Garcia, thank you. Mm -hmm. And lawmakers in Washington, D.C. are working on legislation to save the student loan market. A bill passed the House yesterday that would, if the, the, would have the state treasury department guarantee student loans if need be. And that bill still needs to pass through the Senate. Also tonight, Denver police are interviewing the driver of a 